Hello dear friends of air conditioning systems. You have an electric vehicle from the Volkswagen Group in your workshop and you need to carry out the maintenance on the vehicle. And the maintenance plan states the following. Renew the refrigerant. Unfortunately, you notice that the sticker in the engine compartment says the following. R744. Oops! What is that? It is also possible that the following error message is displayed in the cockpit. Air conditioning system is not working correctly. Visit the workshop. In both cases you have to carry out an R744 air conditioning service on a heat pump. How to do this without major investments I will show you in this video. So, here I am again. First question of you is mostly, what is needed for an R744 air conditioning service? And the second question is, how much does it cost? I will show you a simple affordable solution. As a long term trainer of vehicle air conditioning technologies, I have the solution for you. Our new R744 filling set for Volkswagen heat pump systems. The advantage is that the set is easy to handle and not too expensive. This means that every workshop in the world will be able to carry out an R744 air conditioning service. But one disadvantage I have to mention. There is no printer. But really, do you need a printer? Not really. But what you need is the refrigerant R744. You can choose between two systems. Filling with an optional scale and directly from a 10 kg R744 bottle or from our pre-filled R744 cylinders. Both options are possible. I will show you the filling with the scale and the 10 kg bottle. Additionally, you have to provide your R 134A air conditioning service machine and of course your pers personal protective equipment because I'm a trainer and I'm looking very often that the people are not working correctly. And what you also need is a diagnostic tool. Which diagnostic tool you have in the workshop I don't care. It can be Volkswagen Otis or the VCDS but it called it can also come from Bosch, Hella Gutmann or Word. The only thing that matter is to be able to access the basic settings of the air conditioning systems with your di diagnostic tool. Because before we start the air conditioning service, we have to activate the solenoid wafers and I will show you how it is working with the VCDS tool. But now let's start step by step. Before you start, check the ball wave is closed so that no refrigerant can escape. Connect the service coupling to the low pressure side to allow the refrigerant to flow into the hose line. After connection, you can use the pressure and boiling temperature to see whether there is still liquid or only gases refrigerant in the system. This tells you whether the system is tight or leaking. Before you start the air conditioning service, the vehicle must be taken into a private area. This is important so that the customer cannot start the air conditioning via the Volkswagen app. In addition, you must set the air conditioning to off during the air conditioning service. After conditioning the vehicle, you must control the solenoid valves with your diagnostic device. Unfortunately, I can only show this section in German with my VCDS. 
Please just follow the process, which is a little different for each diagnostic device. There is an optional waste oil container for the filling set. This can be mounted on the filling set before draining the refrigerant. The refrigerant is drained by turning the ball wave slightly to the left. It is very important that the refrigerant is drained very, very slowly. Of course, you can drain the refrigerant without a use oil container, but here too, the refrigerant must be drained very slowly. If you do it too quickly, dry ice can form. Here you can see the refrigerant flowing out of the system. And at some point, you will have drained all of the refrigerant. After draining the refrigerant, you can now carry out repairs. But before you fill the air conditioning system, the air conditioning system must be evacuated. To do this, connect your 134 air conditioning unit to the right side of the filling set. Then turn the ball wave to the right so that you can evacuate the air conditioning system. After vacuuming, you have the option of adding fresh oil. There's an optional oil injector for this. The oil injector is connected to the right of the filling set and the oil is sucked into the system via the vacuum. First, we screw our bottle adapter onto the 10 kg R744 cylinder. We can then mount the filling set onto the cylinder. and open the bottle wave on the refrigerant bottle. Now you can place the refrigerant bottle on the filling scale and then set the weight to zero. You start the filling by turning the ball wave to the left. When the filling level has been reached, close the ball wave. After filling, use your diagnostic tool to complete the basic settings of the air conditioning system and the privacy area. For the test, the air conditioning system is set to maximum cooling.
When the air conditioning starts, the electric compressor also starts. The compressor sucks and the suction pressure on the pressure gauge drops. The compressor also sucks the hose line dry. It is important that the suction pressure drops to 0 degrees Celsius or below. This tells you that the air conditioning is cooling properly. Then close the bottle wave on the R744 cylinder. Then the filling set can be removed from the cylinder. Now you can unscrew the service coupling on the vehicle. Now you can drain the remaining gas from the hose line and disconnect the service coupling from the vehicle. This completes the air conditioning service. If you liked this video, we would be happy if you would like it. For more information, you can contact us by email at info at activesales.de. We say thank you and goodbye.